So, YouTube family, help your boy DJ bless one out right quick. Tyrese Gibson, they're coming for you, and I don't mean them, I mean they. And it does, it'll make sense in a little bit. Tyrese Gibson has been ordered to pay his ex-wife $10,000 per month in child support. That's like $120,000 a month. We're going to get into that a little bit more and break these things down. It's also a win for the recording artist. And this thing is also a loss at the same time. It's going to make sense. This judge was not playing around with Tyrese at all and a lot was said. Yes, this man has to pay 10000 the one they call Tyrese Gibson 10,000 get over here boy you hear what I'm saying but we're gonna start the news the right way but let's start with the intros and get going uh heard rappers won't be ha ha that's a good joke whoever thought I fell off man y'all smoking on some good dope blowing in spitting 16s that's a football got it out the mud but keeping clean like some good soap you ever heard of a real street nigga that told nope me neither that's why I stick to the code ain't no click hopping wick I'ma stick with the bros why pro now you see Tyrese Gibson if you guys don't know he went to his court situation with his ex-wife and Mrs. Lee that is uh Samora Lee I hope I said her or Soraya Lee that is you know um and actually I just messed that up her name is Samantha Lee Samora Lee is his daughter that is and he has to pay all these amounts in court we'll go through videos and everything to break this thing down how all this started and what's the drama with it now if you guys don't know he will now have to pay ten thousand six hundred and ninety thousand I mean ninety dollars you feel me per month for the child support for his estranged wife Samantha now the judge made the order for the best interest of the ex's three-year-old daughter Soraya Lee at the courtroom in Georgia on Tuesday now the fast and furious star that is Tyrese that they call him he wasn't liking it at all he kept mean mugging the wife looking at attorneys her attorney that is and, and as any one of us would be doing but also I like to be fair on both sides if you are the wife as well or the ex-wife that is is, you're also gonna look at for your better interest whether me or you guys agree with her or not humans tend to look out for their interest even if she's not looking out for the child at all I don't know I don't want to call you know cast all these type of allegations at her way but we did see a lot of the ups and down and it's not pretty at all I want y'all to look at some of the things the judge said to this man and, and what was really going on with the entire situation what it was looking at and now these are some of the things when judge was speaking to tyrese about his manner in the courtroom talking to tyrese how tyrese handled the situation let's go into that and, and, and look into it tender petitioners exhibit 57 mr gibson's 2018 tax return. No objection, If I recall your testimony correctly, Mr. Gibson, mm -hmm. you said 2018 you were financially in quote shambles. Is that correct? Yeah. So in 2018, when you were financially in shambles. Do you know how much you made that year? I don't. Well, according to your tax return, you made $2.221 million. It's page this 32. Do you want to check my math? No, sir, I'm asking you because I don't do the CFO thing. Here's a question to you, smart no. person. Hey, that's enough. You right. go sit down. We're taking a break. Lawyer's back now. If you do it again, I'm going to hold you in contempt. You don't ask me questions. That's not how this works. Now, apparently, as you can see, that judge did not like Tyree's tone at all. I'm going to be fair here. The judge was somewhat unprofessional, somewhat showing his overtones or underturns, should I say. But Tyrese as well should know he's in a battle for his 
so-called life as far as comfortability to get his daughter back you know the courtroom is not in our favor bro like just let them get that and come in another day to go again in another battle don't do it in court so even though he was speaking to the attorney because many people in the comment sections was flooding tyree's situation and saying that he was wrong he was speaking kind of wild to the judge and i said he wasn't speaking to the judge that way he was speaking to the attorney but nonetheless these magistrates sit over these court case and they got a lot of biasness towards certain people especially men already have a biasness but especially when you look like tyrese you gotta know they are coming for you bro listen to me they are coming for you it's not a joke now listen to what this judge said to both parents as far as as the situation dwindled down to the end of the court procedure hang on y'all i'm gonna let y'all listen to this and y'all tell me what y'all thought of the judge speaking to the parents Okay, this one having audio issues, so I'll just tell you. What he's basically saying here to both parents, he basically was talking to them and letting them know the situation. You are not going to be speaking in my court. That was one of the first things he said. You are not going to, you know, a lot, a lot of things. He was like, did everybody lose? In fact, let me read what one of the court reporters wrote down so we can actually read this together what he said. Now, he said, nobody wins here. You know, everybody didn't lose. Everybody didn't win. It's a situation where it's still going to be glimpse and worry in a certain climate. Now, this judge seems to have it for Tyrese or it's just the way these family court procedures go. I should know very well. Go to some of my videos to understand what I'm talking about. But Tyrese, both him and Samantha took the stand at the court hearings this week to give testimony over their finances. Samantha was grilled about cosmetic surgery she had done, while Tyrese upset the judge when he reportedly got snip snippy with one of the his ex-wife's attorney, as y'all all seen. Now, according to TMZ, the judge interrupted Tyrese and snapped. He said, You don't ask questions. That's not how it works. The judge basically report reportedly threatened the whole Tyrese in contempt of court meanwhile it's also stated that Tyrese won't be shelling out twenty thousand dollars no more in court that's right she was trying to get twenty thousand dollars in child support alone that's not even alimony let me cough right quick because I just got sick hearing that <laughs> Woo, no Rona 19 over here but meanwhile it also states that Tyrese He's basically going to go back in court allegedly later to defend that situation as well because now he has to pay back child support some somewhere in the lease of $209,000 basically because Tyrese also paid Samantha's car note for two years ago. The judge also took off $46,000. Now, before I read any more of this and, and go anymore, let's look at some of the videos more. We can't just downplay it. Now, we looked at the judge speaking his part. Now, this is Tyrese explaining certain things. I honestly think, I don't think none of these videos worked in my favor to at least start, but we can at least go to the famous video of Tyrese telling y'all, leave him alone. This is all I got. This is all I got. Don't take my baby, okay? I've been, I've been away from my baby for two months. I just want my baby. I just want my baby. And no one's listening because no one's in the courtroom. I'm not doing anything illegal. I'm not doing anything illegal, but I don't want nobody... Oh my God, am I doing something illegal by doing this video or is this, am I protected by the, the, the first right amendment or the amendment? Don't take my baby. I'm at $13,000 a month. What more do you want from me? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh. Now, me personally, I didn't find the situation funny at all. You got a man going through a certain type of crisis in his life. And all he wanted at that time was basically to see his child be with her. And a lot of people took offense to that. They said Tyrese is actually in the wrong. I've been reading the females comments and a lot of 
<coughs> I had to cough again because I'm feeling increasingly sick about that. Now, you're looking at the situation. Tyrese said what he said, and it didn't go well with certain people in the comment section. They let him have it. They blamed him. Everything so let's let him good. talk. Look at your mansions, look at your private planes, look at your Rolls Royces, look at your diamonds, look at all of the celebrities that are at every party and every event that everybody goes to, because everything is about clicks and entourages. I want everything to be super quiet, because not only do I have stories to tell, not only do these stories change lives and carry a camera up to look at the balcony. Look at this. TV, you're selling this narrative every single day, every day, every day, every day. And you say, if I say the same thing every day, everybody's going to believe it. You are and was attracted to my life. Anything to go to sleep, you don't need anything. To now, Tyrese gave his parts. He explained where he's coming from. And I can somewhat understand it to a certain point, but I have where the judge spoke to them and i fixed the audio of that by the way but tyrese man he's in for one if this is going to be his judge for the next case he's going to go again because this is what the judge had to say to both parents why he's really oddly enough really talking to tyrese and i need y'all to pay attention to this one right here y'all Okay, I don't know if you guys can hear it or not. Okay, here we go. now me i do agree with the judge when he said nobody won here and nobody lost because honestly somebody did lose the child loses a cordial relationship between both parents it will always be animosity between the two especially after this road hill battle that they went through no i wish them the best man i wish samantha lee the best in life whatever she got going on in her life i wish tyrese gibson the best for his life but ten thousand dollars to the average folks is like a life sentence but for tyrese hopefully you know when the daughter gets to a certain age and status it would be all worth it and i hope the mother samantha lee is really taking that income and putting it in some type of account for the child because lord knows many women no dish well allegedly many women they take that fund and they spend majority of it so when that child is 18 19 asking for where's the money my daddy gave you i need some of it well, go ask your daddy so that won't be the case here hopefully both these parents are mature enough to handle it the right way salute to jason lee of hollywood unlock for this information shout out to hip hop is wired and also tmz man look i'm your guy dj bless one love your family love your kids and most definitely i want y'all to stay blessed have a blessed wonderful day man keep this thing going we do it the right way the true way man let's hit it with that b wick right quick you feel me salute blessings to all of y'all uh,
30 rappers won't be ha ha, that's a good joke. Whoever thought I fell off, man, y'all smoking on some good dope. Blowing in, spitting 16s, that's a football. Got it out the mud, but keeping clean like some good soap. You ever heard of a real street nigga that told? Nope, me neither, that's why I stick to the code. Ain't no click hopping wick, I'ma stick with the bros. Why I pull a whole zip when I get lit with a foe? Why I cry about a bitch, say my tears for the dough? If I ever take a loss, hustle up, get some more. Can't forget about them times I was down bad and broke. Promise I'd never switch, and I put that on my soul. Chef Wick got my cookbook, whipping in the 